Molly. Hello, uh, Mr. Fry. Uh, my name is Molly. I know. And, hello. <laughs> um, and you see what's coming, don't you? I do. <laughs> And uh, so I would like to present my question to you in the form of a serenade. It's kind of the most delicate way to pose it, I suppose. And I know it is a question shared by um, s at least several young women. <laughs> Your heart is promised to a man, and so I have no hope to win it. But consider my proposal, sir. If you can find a minute, I think the future of our species would be better with you in it. I know you have your problems, and maybe I have mine. But you should leave someone to carry on when you, you have turned to dust and plant your genome in an infant, sir. I think it's only just, and you would need someone to bear this child, a woman you can trust. I'll put my body on the line. Mr. Stephen Fry, I see no reason why you wouldn't want someday, maybe, to let me have your baby. You would be amazed what science does these days, so think it over and tell me what you think. for this position, which I hope you will not doubt. I've got those childbearing hips you always hear so much about. I have permission from my boyfriend, and he'd like to help you out. I know it isn't much, but it's what I have to give. And I don't drink, and I don't smoke, and I eat all my leafy greens. I'll try to go to bed much earlier. I'll get all my vaccines, and I'll put headphones on my belly. And I'll cut back on caffeine, I'll hang an iPad the crib. Oh, Stephen Fry, I see no reason why you wouldn't want someday maybe to let me have your baby. And I'm in my prime, so you've got loads of time. So when you're ready, let me what you think. You deserve to reproduce. And I was built to procreate. I hope my womb can be of use So think it over, I can wait And one day if you're sure of it Then I could be your surrogate is nearly guaranteed cause I have all the tools that you require to breed so send along your seed Do you want to answer that? Or? 